If your computer is taking a long time to access your drive, or is suddenly very slow, could it be that there's an issue with your drive? I'll show you how you can check the health of your drives. Modern drives have monitoring in them called Smart, Self-Monitoring Analysis, and Reporting Technology, which can tell you if a drive has failed or is imminent of failure. You can get the Smart data on your drive through the command line, but there's also GUI front ends available. I'll be installing the recently released QDisk Info and showing a good drive and one of my bad drives. I'm currently running Ubuntu and you can install it from Git or via the PPA. PPA is Personal Package Archives and I'll be installing it through the PPA for this video. So to get started, open up a terminal. I'm going to add in the repository. sudo add app repository ppa ubuntu handbook 1 qdisk info hit enter and then run a sudo apt update and then now I'm going to install qdisk info Now I'm going to run QDisk Info. Put in my password. All right, so it comes up here and we can see right away that I have two good drives and the health status on this one's 98%. And it saves my drive here. And then here are the attributes. For example, raw read error rate, reallocated sector count, initial bad block count, remaining lifetime percentage, erase fail count chip, and so on. So there's no issues on this drive. And now I'm going to plug in a bad drive that I have. All right, the drive is in, and now I'm going to do a refresh. And we can see it comes up, it says dev SDC, and it's bad. The health status is bad. And there are two attributes here, B4 and E7, and it's coming up as unknown GMF attributes for both of them. And the reason why it's coming up as unknown GMF attributes is because it's not being recognized or it's not explicitly documented. So what you can do is you can reach out to the vendor in regards to your drive and in regards to the ID. So this is in hex before and E7. So for me, B4, this one is the spare block count, and E7 is the drive life, and the threshold for my drive life is 5, and the raw value I have here is 6401, which it has surpassed. And also as well as the power on hours for my drive here is only 971 hours, which is only about 40 days, and it's already bad. And I noticed I was having issues with my drive as I wasn't able to access anything. So if I go open up a terminal and I do a sudo fdisk-l dev sdc. And let's say if I want to mount SDC1 as an example. And if it doesn't fail, this will probably take a long time. Currently right now at the top, it's 1642. And it's finally mounted. And we can see at the top, it's 1645. And if I try to list the contents under the mount directory, It's just hanging. So my cursor is now frozen. I'm going to try to get out of this. And I'm going to try to unmount it now. And so I was able to unmount. So that's good. And going back into QDisk info. So that's it. 
That's how you can check the health of your drives using QDesk Info in Linux. I hope this video was useful and I thank you for watching. Bye now.